Queen's business leaders gathered for the first charter meeting of the Greater Flushing Chamber of Commerce. The meeting inside Flushing Town Hall recognized a newly elected Council of Advisors and a Board of Directors, both made up of community members who say they will work to represent neighborhood businesses. Uh, it's important uh, that the business community have a voice. Uh, because uh, in a lot of public hearings in the city hall, I don't see any people come from Flushing uh, to advocate for the interests of Flushing small business people. We're going to be doing our best to make sure that uh, we get our fair share of resources from city government, from state government, federal government, that we are uh, respected when it comes to decisions around land use, around developments that are taking place in Flushing. In Flushing, there are lots of different communities, um, and we're of the opinion that uh, there's much more that unites us as a business community, as one business community, than divides us as various different ethnic communities. Chamber organizers say it's the first council for flushing in several years.